Hello there everyone, Kwaniki D here, welcome back to another video. So today's video is kind of a special little treat for you guys. I found this little hidden gem on the internet yesterday and I thought I'd review it. So before I start, I hope you, everybody enjoyed the Bachelor series. Trust me, it'll be back. I'll do the Bachelorette at some time, at some point in this thing, maybe after Parenthood or during the end of it. And my Parenthood video premieres later today. So um, I'm super excited for everything and thank you for your support. Um, yeah. Anyways, this video is called Five Things That Were Supposed To Be In City Living. As you see right here, or like in general, the Sims 4 team always has to make concept arts. And they, they have to get their ideas from somewhere, is basically what I'm trying to say. And this was one of their ideas for city living. A small little apartment, but we never really got those small little apartments. And I really wish we did. So I was looking at this and I was like, wow. There's a lot of stuff that we didn't get in The Sims 4 City Living that is, like, super cool here. So, I'm going to review it for you and tell you guys what we didn't get. First things first, we're going to start here. Um, as you see right here, on this same, same exact counter, we have a toaster. We don't, unless it's a microwave, that one might be a microwave. But that is definitely a toaster, okay? If so, anyways... It's a toaster, okay? It looks like a toaster. Maybe it's a microwave, but there's a toaster there. So, a toaster, no matter what it is. We don't have toasters. Why don't we have a toaster? I like toast. I like bread. Bread turns into toast. Why don't we have a toaster? Like, I think it'd be such a cool interaction. Anyways, number two. This half oven or half stove there is no oven if you guys don't know in a lot of like rvs and smaller apartments they don't have ovens because if you think about it you don't really need an oven to live you need a stove you just need to heat things up you need a stove this is a half stove how cool is that if i was trying to make like a space saving like room build or something like that and to have a stove like that is so cool like a half one that's crazy i'm sorry and number three is this sink where it's just, ha it's like a double sink, but half of it is covered. This is not that big of a deal, but it's still something, you know? Number four, the thing that is getting me the most, a mini fridge. What? How could they skip up? skip a mini fridge we got mini fridges in university in the sims 3 and let me tell you i used that mini fridge in every single house i would never actually put a real one i would put a mini one or in the kids rooms i would put mini fridges just it is so cool like why don't we have a mini fridge this that is something that's essential to life like sims 4 you have vampires but no mini fridges let that sink in everybody where are the mini fridges i'm, I'm sorry we need mini fridges that, that's just my opinion. Number five is a combined effort. There is actually six of them, or there's a couple more than five. I just titled the video five. But number five, a washing machine? Oh my gosh. A washing machine. I know washing machines are rumored for eco-living, which is why, like, people might have... And why the Sims team might have put washing machines as a possibility, but why couldn't we get it with city living and like the under the counter washing machines? Like, it makes so much sense. This just makes so much sense. Okay, so another thing that we didn't get this is very subtle, and I don't even know if you guys noticed it, but right here there's a window and there's a little plant on the window it's very simple but we don't have that kind of option to put plants on window sills in the sims 4 so the fact that that's a little option i mean i know you can't remove the windows in apartments but if we were to just get them you know i think it'd be kind of this a cute little addition and now another major one a murphy bed look at this this is crazy you could either bring it down or bring it out like why didn't we get murphy beds we got them in the sims 2 apartments and i honestly thought that when we got city living it was going to be a like an essential like a key to this um was going to be a key to this um expansion pack but it wasn't and i was a little surprised but i think um trundle beds they would have made a great 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 addition 
Okay, now we're going to scroll to a couple more pictures that I have. So this one is of a bathroom. Um, I think we pretty much nailed the bathroom. We have this painting. We don't have this mirror, but I don't really mind. It's just a mirror. We have, like, the toilet and the sink. We don't have this thing. And we don't have this thing. The only thing here that I would have liked is this thing. I like the wood accents in the shower. But we pretty much got everything in this bathroom. The second one here is this loft. Now, we did not get this loft. In no way, shape, or form did we achieve lofts. And look at these platforms. And these couches are unbelievable. But this is what we need in The Sims 4. There's no constrained floor elevation in The Sims 4. And it's just, it's just plain, like, flat. And this, if you can't see, is, like, going up one level and then going up another level. That is what we need. And then glass walls, like, we don't have this or this. Like, this is just crazy. If this were to have come with The Sims 4 City Living, I guarantee you every single builder would have gone crazy. And we would have, like, 20 times the amount of things that are in the gallery right now. This just looks crazy. I love this light fixture, too. I mean... Don't get me wrong, The Sims 4 City Living is a great expansion pack, and it brought us so many things, but just these simple things, like steps and different levels and lofts, that would have been an amazing addition. This next one is, kind of looks like it was from, uh, movie Hangout stuff, but ultimately, we got stuff like this. We got a lot of rugs. I ain't going to complain about rugs. Um, some buildings and whatnot. Like, this is a pretty small apartment. This is an apartment building right here that they're practicing on, and it's not even in city uh, the city of Samai Shuno. So something I wish they would have done is make apartments for other worlds, but that wasn't a thing. And this looks pretty small, and I kind of like that. Um, this is the picture we already reviewed. This one, this one's pretty spot on. Like, we don't have this thing, and we don't have these many, like, colorful things. But the thing that really, or we don't have this light, that light would have been cool. And these, like, boiler tanks, that would have been cool. And lights and things like that for design purposes. But the thing that I'm looking at is this fan. Why don't we have fans? That That's it. We don't have any fans. Here's an, a representation of more so what our lofts are looking like now. Because we don't have those kind of, um, like, different level things. So this is kind of what our loft looks like. And I don't mind. It still looks amazing. All this furniture we pretty much have. Um, there's also a corner fireplace there. Um, we didn't have that, but that's okay. Uh, these are some, you know, renders of... The fashion district and the arts quarter spice market they pretty much nailed all of that um and then this is a, probably a representation of the spice market they did a pretty good i mean i'm not going to complain about the world this looks pretty interesting that's a little interesting design i'm kind of glad it didn't turn out like that but anyways that is pretty much it for what was supposed to be in city living i'm not going to say what's supposed to be but like ideas that were you know, thought of for city living. This is probably, like, my biggest grudge. This whole room right here. Mini fridges, um, washing machines, and tr Murphy beds. Like, oh my gosh. Th those are just getting to me. And toasters. I love toast. How can I forget toasters? Um, that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And if you had to pick one item that I reviewed today, so, you know, mini fridges, toasters, anything. If you had to pick one item out of what I showed you today, fans, it doesn't matter. Air vents. What would you have wanted in The Sims 4 City Living? Just one. Put it in the comments down below. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned. My Parenthood video is coming out later today. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys all again next time. Goodbye.